Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do an update for my rolling pan project pan collab. I'm doing this with Joy, Jessica, Amanda and Kara, I believe. So this project is all about hitting pan. And when you hit pan on a product, you roll another product into the project. Therefore the rolling pan. And all the items is like pans, so compacts and stuff like that. This update I have hit pan on two items, so therefore I am rolling two new products in. And yeah, I will just shortly recap how many things I have hit pan on so far because this is this is my fourth update, so four months. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine products so far. So far I have hit pan on nine products and I'm pretty excited about that. We still have two months to go, so this ends late November and it is October 1st today. So two months. I'm pretty excited and I really hope I can hit pan on some products before the next update so I can roll in some new products, get some use out of my collection again. The first product is my Nutrilux bronzer. It is quite beaten up and the pattern here it is it has rubbed off. It was a flower. I have had this bronzer in since the beginning. And you know what? I have hit pan on it. I'm so excited. I don't know how long I have been working on this, but it has been forever, like half a year or something. I have used it as a contour. The last month I haven't used it that much because since I've hit pan I was just like, I need a break. <laughs> I just don't really use contour anymore because this is very very cool toned and it is very pigmented so I don't need a lot. But I have used it as a contour, I have used it as an eyebrow powder so that's why I could hit pan on it. So yeah. I have it pan and I can now roll this out and it is now only in my subscription box splits project pan. Last time I added in this Clua Vaseline, so Vaseline, Vaseline, still don't know. I've hit pan on it. I'm so excited. This stuff goes by so slowly. <laughs> you don't need much. And I have used this every single evening after my skincare before I go to bed. And it has been working like a dream. Used it on my cuticles, on my lips. I love this stuff so much. And then I still have my Manicada Duo and it is a highlighter and a bronzer. This past month I haven't used it that many times but I have tried to use it a bit. I have used it today as my highlight and the bronzer I have used here on my lower lash line. I haven't used it as a bronzer but it is still here. I don't know if I can hit pan on it because there is so much product in this. Now for the two items I'm going to roll in instead of the Vaseline, Vaseline and the bronzer. The first item is my Maybelline Colors 2 in On and On Bronze and it is looking like this. It has a nice dip in it and I'm pretty sure I can hit pan on this because I go through a cream eyeshadow fairly quickly. Maybe too quickly, I don't know. I have been using it a lot lately and I'm very excited about working on it again. Again, and maybe I can wear it with my Manicada Duo and some other shadows I'm panning right now. And the next eyeshadow is in this C palette I reorganized after my Panda Palette finale. And if you haven't seen that, I will link it up here because I had this full of shadows from a Panda Palette and now they are gone. So I have departed some new stuff into this palette. There's some um, Benefit Flushes and Singles and my Manicada Duo down here and I'm adding in this cool tone crease color and 
I really really like this color. You can't see it that much, so that's why it's a very very nice shade for the crease and transition and stuff like that. So I'm trying to hit pan on it. As you can see, it has cracked since I deep parted it in this video up here, and the same with the other shades. But I really like it, and I have used it a fair amount since I rearranged my palette. That is everything for this video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you will check out the other ladies down below. It is the big upload day for us, so I hope you will check them out. They are lovely. I love them so much, and the channels are amazing. So yeah, I hope you will check them out and stay tuned for other updates and projects and stuff like that so you don't miss out. There's a subscribe button down below, like this video and follow my social media and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!